Then a Village Voice story comes, and it discloses our drug operation, our whole, our complete enterprise. And so, you know, like any article, I had to give him a right of reply, and I invited Crusoe up to the office, to the Village Voice. There's this story coming out on Wednesday, and it basically says you, you were the limelight's drug kimping. You know, I need your reaction. And he's like, oh, yeah, it's this and this and that. I say, well, Michael, I have this person saying this and that person, and we went through the whole thing. And then he starts to say, I've known you for years, Frank. Why are you doing this to me? You know I've just had a new baby. And I said, I said, that's got nothing to do with it. I said, I said, this is what I got. And he starts shaking like this. And I think, uh oh, oh, he's gonna come across the room and try and strangle me. And all of a sudden he just bursts into tears and starts blubbing like a spanked toddler. And <laughs> he gets up and he goes, he goes, what do you think I should do? Do you have any advice? And I just said, Yeah, Michael, I think you should get a really good lawyer. And sure enough, we get picked up. They go out and they arrest Michael Caruso now, the fourth informant in the case. What do you want to do? I want to take the deal against Peter. 